Hi everybody, this is a mad laser tutorial and we're going to learn how to quickly get a beam going through your laser. So first thing I want to do in MadMapper 5 is go to File, New, I want to make a new laser project. Boom, so here's my laser projector. Let me make it this bigger. As you can see, this is green. It's not uh, yellow because green is the color we've chosen for laser. So first thing, I want to go to my outputs. And you can see I have this laser output right here and the destination actually I'm using Shownet. So Mad Laser is compatible so far with Shownet, with Etherdream, Helios and FB4. So for this tutorial I'm using Shownet. Okay, so the laser is connected. All right, super good. And as you can see, there are two green lines. Uh, one is the, the main uh, outline and the other one, the faint one, is the safe zone. So there is a safety area, as you can see. I can change, in, change it like that. It's very important uh, because the laser won't shoot in, outside this safety area. So here, there won't be anything. Here, I'm going to be able to project. Okay, so I'm setting up this safety area. Uh, my device is set up to 30k PPS, point per second. This is very standard. I could change it to match my scanner. And I want to shoot at around 60 FPS. So first thing I want to I wanna do is make sure that uh, I'm shooting somewhere and I want to make sure that my uh, safety area is uh, properly aligned. So what, what, can, what I can do here is render the safety area. So I click here, I render the safety area. And now if I arm my laser, uh, the laser should be shooting something. So for this, uh, I want to show you what's going on. So I'm going to make a, a camera right here. So this is my camera shooting at my wall. And now if I open up my laser, it's starting. And if I arm the lasers, okay, there is a warning because it's very powerful, dangerous. Don't shoot at your friends. Be careful for your eyes. Be careful for your audience. Okay, boom. And now I cannot see anything because I guess that my safety area is uh, too big for my camera. So let me make it smaller. Oh yes, you can see there is something going on here. I can pump up the level of the safety area, right? So right now I'm shooting at the wall, I'm shooting there, and this is happening inside my safety area. Great. So let's remove that. And now I can just go to this tab, which is the laser surfaces tab. And I can start by uh, making a line like this. Boom. OK, so now you can see I'm shooting right now. But strangely, this laser, because I'm using Shownet, is flipped. So I can go there and use the flipping option. Boom. So that it matches uh, what I'm sending. OK. And of course, I can make something else. Let's try to make a text. OK, so here I'm putting a text and you can see if I move it, it goes out the safe zone. It's not rendered inside. It's rendered. OK, and you can see here in my preview, I am previewing uh, laser beams and you can set it up right here in the laser beam preview option. OK, so now you're going. Thanks for watching.